Hi, my name is Richard Bucari from Pointer and Bucari, and today I want to talk about one of the most important issues uh, that uh, require you to hire an attorney uh, right away in order to be able to effectively uh, pursue a dram shop case. So again, a dram shop case is a case against a uh, bar, for instance, that uh, serves somebody that's knowingly, uh, knowingly serves somebody that's intoxicated, and as a result of that, intoxication, that person goes out and hurts somebody else. Uh, so that's your typical dram shop case. And a lot of times these are bars or restaurants that are, uh, that are being sued for these types of claims. But these cases are so hard because, first of all, you have to be able to find out where the drunk person was uh, in, in, in when they got intoxicated. Where were they drinking alcohol? Where were they being served alcohol? And if that person gets arrested for a DUI, then they have the right to remain silent, they have an attorney right away, and that attorney's not going to be cooperative as far as even admitting that they were drinking at all, uh, but uh, even on top of that, uh, they're not gonna be cooperative as far as saying where they drank or how much they had to drink, and that, that's obviously uh, one of the more difficult things to prove is that the bar knew that they were intoxicated uh, at the time. And so what has to happen is that you need an attorney to spring into action right away to figure these things out. So when we got hired on a case recently, uh, what we had to do is we had to hire an investigator and basically uh, we had to go on the, uh, on the drunk driver's social media to figure out uh, if we could where he could have potentially been. And then when we found out uh, that we had some people that uh, may have known something about it, then we went and interviewed those people and eventually we were able to find the bar that uh, he was being served at. And then once you have that information, then you need to immediately contact that bar and make sure that they are preserving evidence that can be used to show that they served him while he was intoxicated, Where that, whether that is video at the scene or receipts or uh, schedules that show who the people were that were working at the time, uh, the names of other uh, patrons that may have observed something. Those are all things that need to be immediately preserved. And if you even wait... Uh, 30 days or 60 days, uh, even even a couple of weeks, uh, video could be lost, and uh, then those other important papers and other documents that could help prove your case could be lost as well. So it's absolutely positively important if you uh, suffer a severe injury as a result of a drunk driver that you contact an attorney right away to help start preserving evidence. Because if you don't, then your case for a dram shop case could be lost. And the reason why that's important is because oftentimes a person uh, who is drunk driving and uh, usually uh, is, is not the most responsible person in the world and probably doesn't have either insurance or adequate amounts of insurance to cover a serious injury. And so you're going to need to go after the bar and their commercial policy in order to be able to fairly compensate you for this. If you have any questions, please give us a call at Pointer and Bucari.